Now at six, for the past few years, buying a new home often meant you had to make an offer quickly to have a chance at buying it. But realtors in North Alabama believe this might be changing this year. Way 31's Matt Paskowitz is live tonight in Madison. And Matt, what will make this year different for possible buyers? Hey, Dan and Nikel. Well, inventory of homes are beginning to grow here in Madison County, which is giving potential home buyers and more opportunities to look before signing their names on the contract. But there is one issue. High interest rates are still scaring potential home buyers from even considering looking. We have a lot of family activities that are really attractive, a lot of parks, a lot of schools that are really nicely rated. For Lauren Samadani and her husband, they're ready to buy a new home. And at first glance, it seems like an attractive time to do so. They're able to take their time, able to come. Most of the buyers I have and represent have relocated from the area, so they're not well versed in the area. This is a complete shift from a year ago when buying a house felt like participating in a marathon. So last year, definitely, we were up against 20, 30 multiple offers. Um, you really did not have time as a buyer to even sleep on it. But Sabadani said there is something keeping her and her husband from signing the contract. There's been some resistance because of the, of the rates being so high. And um, I, just, I just keep telling my husband, uh, it's not something that I care for. <laughs> CNN reported the 30-year fixed mortgage rate averaged at 6.13% this past week. They've done a really great job with that. Up from the 3.5% it was at a year ago. Realtors still say the time is right to purchase a home as the market is still unpredictable. I am like calling all of them that aren't even planning to buy for a year out or so and really sharing with them the perks of buying right now and what that means for them that we just can't guarantee six months, nine months, a year from now out because uh, it's definitely a, an exciting buying time. The city of Huntsville says it approved last year about 1,700 new single-family unit lots, but many eyes are still on the Federal Reserve, who are planning to meet from January 31st to February 1st, with them potentially considering raising those interest rates once again. Reporting live in Madison, I'm Matt Pasquitz, Wait 31 News.